good morning. It's fall and it's time to sheet mulch with leaves to block the weeds. And we're gonna decorate for Halloween. Come on. I practice what's called chop and drop. That means plants like vegetables, flowers, weeds, I chop them off and just throw them in the garden and leave them there. Now we're going to cover them up and that's going to block them from growing again. It's a good way to feed the soil. I'm going to go to the front and get some cardboard. Fall sheet mulching is the secret to my growing success. It's the one priority for my success. Hey, you see this line here and this line here? Where they meet, weeds will grow through. So you have to make sure you block that with more cardboard. This edge I leave so that fall vegetables can continue to grow. Now, we're gonna get some fall, some dried leaves. Now you can use straw or hay. You can also buy wood mulch. If you use fresh wood chips, then you can't plant right away. You have to wait for those wood chips to break down. You want a thick layer because the leaves will break down. Now I'm limited because I only have four bags. My area has just started collecting leaves, but Dill will keep his eye out for more bags for me. Later I'll come back and I'll overlap the edge. Because if I just leave it like that, with the soil exposed, weeds will grow. I don't worry about toxins in the cardboard. From my research, it shows that the ink is soy-based. And it'll break down. Now, it's a good idea to take the tape off, but I don't always do that and remove the staples. Worms love cardboard. 
they will just flop. Now let's decorate for fall. We're ready for fall.